na ya Kisumu Fast Runs. Kumbe nimekuwa ni market nayo na ni yako na ni Sasa kama unataka hiyo jina if you still want that name kindly give me a particular amount of money. I ask me how much. I want 70,000. This is the way to do it. 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 So you discover it's registered. You don't have the 70,000. What next? Vile nilisikia hivyo nilikata simu. I went straight back home. Nikajifungia kwa bedroom, nikalia for one hour. Mm. I terribly cried and I I cast myself and I said rubbish this thing can never work. Mm. I'm going to give up on these things. The dreams I had kwenda kabisa hizi mambo gani haya. Then you know now I'm grieving. Lots of This is this is like now losing another baby. This is like losing a baby actually. Because after losing my brother now it's like I've lost my baby. Then <laughs> after about a month I gather the courage and I tell the world on my Facebook page that the name Kisumu Fast Errands is not longer ours. We can't advertise using it. Please don't refer to us as Kisumu Fast Errands until such a date when we'll find a new name. Mm-hmm. Then my customers, the ones I had gotten, start calling. Brand Ninini, Brand, what is happening? Brand, what is going on? How can we support? How can we help? Then now people start come rallying behind me. You have to do it whether you like it or not. Look for a name. So some people start suggesting West Kenya Errands, <laughs> uh, Brand Quick Errands, Fast Errands of Kisumu. Quick and fast errands of West Kenya. West Kenya big errands. All these names are not getting in. We are working and you know it is towards the end of uh, last year. At a time like this. Mm-hmm. We are not talking about we are not advertising we can't put anything on Facebook because or on social media because if somebody told me if you risk doing that if anything is done wrong then it is you. So I say to hell I'm not paying the 70,000 back in Ajina me back in a 70,000 for the more if I had the 70,000 I would just rebrand I would buy a motorbike I would rent an office So Osodo can you take the following names and see if you uh, if they are registered now we have started following the right criteria Remember we started Juakali from my son just mentioning that and uh, let chai mm-hmm. then check we are working there and night everybody is working everywhere because i have an entire team now people are behind me people who are giving me donations brand i've sent you 1000 i know you don't even have anything to eat with your family these are clients who had been serving for the past one year okay everybody is rallying behind me Then from nowhere Osodo calls. Tumepata jina. Zile zingine za West Kenya sijui uh, Nyanza Quickerans sijui gani those ones are gone. But we have found one name amongst all the names that you had given. And direct errands and logistics services was one of them. Yeah. Which I didn't want. Mark you. <laughs> I was not for it because it came last. Because I felt direct errands and logistics services was It's too too ev- wide, true. So now we have the name yes, we have the registration, we are good to go. Then we start working on the logo. Mm. The most powerful logo in West Kenya. We start working on it. So I I I tell my 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 data bank of clients. Mm. I send them a message and I tell them we are coming back bigger and better. and even more tasty. Mm-hmm. Everything I had shelved from from shopping errands to everything, every service because I kept on think I do, I do a lot of research. Niliweka kwa shelf because I can't advertise. Then <laughs> we get the logo, 
everything is out. It is December 2000, uh, 2021. Diaspora is coming back. Kazi zinarudi. Brian, you want to shopping bond? Or Brian, you want to shopping kisum? Brian, a hero. Direct errands is on the ground. Then <laughs> one gentleman says, when we were one day we were at a social joint, I tell them, I want to call this thing Dell Kenya. Dell Services. Mm. No, Dell Services. Then the guy says, ah, Dell Services is too heavy also. Call it Dell's, Dell's, Dell's. That's it, Dell's. Oh, just like DHL. That's where my dream is. That's where my vision is. Mm -hmm. Why logistics? Logistics because that is the ultimate vision where we are going to. Mm -hmm. We want to be the biggest logistics company in West Kenya, the North Rift, and if God allows it and gives us more strength, East and Central Africa. Wow. So then... I now start seeing big companies like FedEx, UPS, United Postal Services, uh, DHL. Then I'm like, uh oh, this is Dell's. All those big companies out there in the West, Dell's is a replica of what they are there, you know? Mm -hmm. So then we say, but if we want to go to Uganda, if we want to be in uh, Juba, if we want to be in South Sudan, then what do we do? Then we have Dell's Kenya. Then after two, three years, we can have Dell's Juba, Dell's Accra, Dell's Cairo, Dell's Kampala, Dell's Johannesburg, Dell's Zambia, Dell's Khartoum. That is such a huge dream. Yeah. Since you've <laughs> talked about the, the, the similarities <laughs> yes. of Dell's Kenya yeah. to the rest, yeah. tell me about the competition. Now that you're Dell's Kenya in Kisumu, yeah. how do you handle the competition from other courier services? The competition mm. is there mm. because we are up against major and established brands, mm. okay. And one of the one of the one of the most important thing to note that does not make us fear anything mm. at the end of the day. Mm. For us, we are giving them a run for the space because we are also in charge of our own space. Mm at the end of the day. Remember, uh, I, I was telling you, the background of how Kisumu first errands changed to direct errands and logistic services. Mm -hmm. This is something that started from petty errands into now a more transformed logistic services. And some of the services we offer include caregiving services. Mm -hmm. That's the first one. Caregiving services was tailored basically for the busy what do you mean by person. caregiving services? Caregiving, that's what I'm explaining. Caregiving services was tailored for the busy person. Mm -hmm. Busy person to mean you are working in the diaspora or you're working in Nairobi, Mombasa, Kitale, mm -hmm. then you have your parents at home. Your parents are at home and you have to take care of them. Dells basically comes in to ensure that your parents are taken care of when they are at home in Dala or any other place where they may be. We take care of them in terms of hospital visits. You go visit the parents. We go visit them if, if, wow. uh, because there are some parents who visit the hospital monthly. Mm -hmm. So we visit them uh, for, uh, we can take them to the clinic. For their annual checkup or monthly checkup or weekly checkup, else can do that. Then they are taken back home. Caregiving services gives you as a client an option, a very a, 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 a space of options that even if it was your mom's birthday, mm. you just give us a call and we go to her. Okay. Care for the elderly is very important, but at the same time, there is no time for you to do that mm. as an individual. Okay, so you can't create time. Come all the way from uh, UK or uh, Saudi Arabia or the uh, or the United Arab Emirates, mm -hmm. where, from where you're working, to just come and see your mother for a day and go back. And at the same time, the people who we leave to take care of our parents, 
Some of them don't take care of our parents. You send a thousand shillings, but your parent only gets 300 shillings. The rest of 700 is pocketed. That's true. Another service that we offer is home checks. Mm. Home checks is also designed and tailored for our clientele in the diaspora or far away from Dala. Okay? Dala here means home. home. <laughs> so, uh, your, your little like house that you've constructed at home, when you live there after Christmas, the next time probably you'll come back is on Easter. Mm -hmm. After Easter, next time is December again. By the time you're coming back, it is dirty, cobwebs all over, it is dusty. You start sweeping. Who has time for that in 2023? Nobody. People want quick and convenient. They can come in, step in, open the door. The fridge is already filled with food. Mm -hmm. You know, groceries have already been supplied there. What does that mean? Home checks gives you a platform and a space whereby you as, an, as our client, mm -hmm. we will take care of your home. Wow. For the rest of the time when you are away. So we take care of your home. Uh -huh. We come there every month or every week or every day. Like there's a client who visit in Yakach, in Bondo, in Kakamega. Mm -hmm. Every month we go there. It is clean. The house is clean. After cleaning, the windows are open so that it can be aerated. The curtains are changed. The beddings are changed. It is fumigated. So if today... Brian calls and says that I'm landing in Kisumu, pick me from the airport, kindly ensure, Del Kenya, kindly ensure my fridge has got uh, this uh, food or supplies of meat, mm -hmm. uh, ensure that toiletries are there, ensure that groceries are there. We will go shop, drop them at the food pantry in your kitchen and leave. So when you get home, you don't start sweeping, you don't start cleaning, you don't start sneezing. You get, you open your door, get to your house, and start cooking. Then we have got another service that we offer, which is generally petty errands. Petty errands around Kisumu. Around Kisumu, we can be able to pick up uh, your laundry. We can, because we offer also laundry services. Mm -hmm. uh, around Kisumu, we can pay your utility bills. Around Kisumu, um, we offer personal assistance services, whereby... Uh, you have a personal assistant on need basis. Mm. You simply just call. Hello, Dells, Kenya. I need a personal assistant to go and attend for me a meeting at KBC offices or Y254 offices. And then the personal assistant will brief you once they're done. And you pay us. Mm. Very simple. Then we have got inter-county deliveries. Inter-county deliveries, majorly, we move shoppings in bulk. So you call us if you're in Nairobi or the diaspora or Mombasa. You call us, you give us a call, you send us a shopping list. Like now we are, we are scheduled to travel to Bomet. Mm -hmm. Look at that. From Kisumu all the way to Bomet. And this is a client in Germany. Okay? Mm -hmm. So you call us, we go shop, you give us the list. If you, can, you can't figure out the list, because we have done this for now two, three years. We have it on our fingertips as Dells. We, just, we can create for you a list mm -hmm. in a span of just 10 minutes with the costs, and then you can budget on that. So we go and shop. After we shop, we take it straight to the doorstep mm -hmm. of your parents in Dala. Okay? Mm -hmm. We will deliver. After we deliver, then you pay us. Yeah. Okay? Then we have got surprise gifting. Mm -hmm. Hello, is that Dell's Kenya? Yes, this is Dell's Kenya. How can we help you? It is my girlfriend's birthday or my fiance's birthday or my wife's birthday. I would like you to surprise her. Where does she work? She works at KBC offices. That's her name. I need a bouquet of flowers. I need some chocolates. I need some uh, uh, a fruit basket and I need some very nice wine. Then you send us. We will purchase. You will pay. Then we will come and surprise Nyangwe so where she is. I'm seeing her happy birthday. And then that service generally just costs about 2,500 to 3,000 shillings. Mm. So we will come, surprise you. Then after we surprised you, 
we take very nice photos of you and we ensure you are happy because it's your day. This does not only work for birthdays, but it also works for uh, apology. It also works for anniversaries. I have done, I have uh, done this service to some clients who really amazed me. There's a client who called us all the way from the United States. And she said, I really miss my father. My father died one year ago. Brian, I want you to purchase flowers and take to my father's grave. I asked, huh? Ah. This Dells is actually a healing to me. It's not a business. This is purpose. Because this is somebody who's this is somebody who does not know my background in grief. Mm -hmm. But this is somebody who has just seen me and said, I can send him. So we purchase the flowers and we go all the way to Migori, next to Tanzania, border. And we lay the, the beautiful flowers on the dad's grave. Mm -hmm. And she's like, You delivered. I tell her I delivered. And she tips me. Wow. I yeah. am intrigued to know. How do you ensure this, the kinds of services you're offering are yeah. very critical yeah. to a customer. Yeah. How do you ensure that you have that trust of a customer and they are happy with <laughs> your services? Uh, word of mouth. Word of mouth. Mm -hmm. Because Bran, Bran doesn't do people wrong. Mm -hmm. Bran is managing a multi-billion company in the next 15 years. Amen to that. <laughs> a multi-billion industry. Mm -hmm. Brian is not interested in pocketing 10 shillings from somebody or a thousand shillings. No. Mm -hmm. Brian is focused on the multi-billion industry for East and Central Africa. Mm -hmm. Dells, Kenya. Mm -hmm. Okay? Mm -hmm. So, basically, we acquire our clientele through social media mm -hmm. marketing and interviews like these ones, okay? And also word of mouth, referrals. I did well here. Somebody says, ah, there is somebody in Kenya who can help you. Mm -hmm. There is somebody in Nairobi who can help you because Dels is now even in Nairobi. Dels is spreading to Mombasa. Dels has already conquered West Kenya and is now unearthing serious revelations in the North Rift. Wow. Big spaces that we are in charge of. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That is so amazing. And uh, as Dells Kenya, do you have people you you in the beginning you said that you had a team behind you. Yes. Now do you have those <laughs> partners that must mama pamoja? Uh, partners Partners, partners, our doors are still open mm -hmm. for very many partners. Mm -hmm. Right now, we are working with a, a, an online store based in Finland because we want to see the first uh, shipping mm -hmm. of online goods that have been bought online, of goods that have been bought online mm -hmm. to Kenya. Mm -hmm. Okay? It's called Roll Me Designs. We are working with them very closely. It's just a matter of contract now, and we are there. Uh, uh, in the hospitality, no, in the apartment uh, sector, we are working very closely with Cozy. Cozy Apartments in Kisum. Mm -hmm. Very amazing guys, uh, the team there. They are our partners because we have got clients who call us and ask us, Brian, uh, Dells Kenya, could you kindly book for me an apartment? I'm coming with my family. I expect you to pick me up from the airport and take me straight to my apartment. Mm -hmm. So we have partnered with them so that we also offer errand and delivery services through them for their guests at the same time. Okay? We have mover services. So we can move offices. We can also move uh, households. Okay? Yeah. And uh, if I may ask, what, you have spoken a lot about the different activities you're doing. Yeah. What is the significant achievement you can mention that really changed Dells? Dells has never changed. Dells is growing. But the significant activity that has made Dells grow even <laughs> further is the fact that this year we participated in uh, 
the African Cities and Local Authority Conference. Afri Cities. That was held in Kisu? In Kisumo. Kisumo Dala. Mm -hmm. Okay? Mm. And we emerged second in the category. Congratulations for okay? that. Mm. So such kind of awards have made us realize as Dells that we are destined for much more. We are in charge of our space and with more reliability, convenience, and trustworthy services, we are destined for higher grounds. Okay? Mm -hmm. But to note of, of importance also is that our ultimate vision and mission for Dells is the one that keeps us, re-energizes us. Mm -hmm. Because like I told you, how about five years from now? How about two years from now? Dells Kenya should be able to get goods from Kisumu International Airport mm -hmm. straight to the J J John F. Kennedy Airport in the United States. Mm -hmm. Okay? Dells should be able and will be able in the next two years. The port is here. We want to use that to our advantage. The railway system was refurbished. The old meter gauge mm -hmm. is there. It is back. It is functioning. That is why we are calling our doors for partners is open because we are calling on even the Kenya Railway Corporation. If we are the biggest in Kisumu Dala, then we should identify with other big brands so that they can help us and they can incubate us mm -hmm. to become bigger than what we are right now. You have conquered the naysayers. You produced an idea and it, someone told you you cannot do it. What would you tell a young person who has an idea, they have gone to someone and they have been told no? No is a two-letter word that if you take it and put it in your mind, then your subconscious will digest it and it will forever stay in your conscious. Mm -hmm. Trust the process, believe in yourself, and most importantly, as an individual, identify and have a mentor. Speak to an individual who mm -hmm. has an idea <laughs> and wants it to prosper as yours has. As a young person out there, there is a reason for every season. There is a purpose that is out there for you. You may go round and round and round and dilly dally round your purpose, but at the end of the day, one dawn you will hit the dart where your purpose lies. And that will be the change of your life forever. Work on your mental health. I'm an advocate of mental awareness. I'm a grief warrior and I'm a believer and I'm knowledgeable on the fact that as an individual, what you speak to yourself is what comes to life. If you speak to yourself and tell yourself that you can do it, you will be able to do it in a split of a second. If you tell yourself that you need more time to do it, then most definitely you need more time to do it. And if you tell yourself that I don't know how to do it, then you don't truly know how to do it. What you tell yourself is very important. Always silence the negative that come in your mind and give sound and increase the base to the positives that hit your mind. Because at the end of the day, it is the positives that matter. The negatives are null and void. Any task, just ask. That's true. Thank you so much, Brian, for being here. You yeah. have produced a very interesting story yeah. and it has a lot of virtues. Yeah. <laughs> the blood, the sweat, and the tears you invest in your dreams 
will not go unnoticed and they will flourish. Take your time and do not say yes to the naysayers. This has been Youth in Action. See you next time. This is the way to do it. This is the way to do it. This is the way to do it.